Here we're asked to solve a linear system by graphing. Let's begin by finding an equivalent system where both of these equations are written in slope-intercept form. Now the first equation, x plus y equals negative 1, can be solved for y if we first subtract x on both sides. And that will leave us with negative x minus 1. Let's look at the second equation. The second equation is negative 2x minus 2y equals 2. Let's begin by adding 2x to both sides. That will leave us with negative 2y equals 2x plus 2. Next, dividing both sides by negative 2 leaves us with slope-intercept form. y equals negative x minus 1. Now notice, both equations in slope-intercept form are the same. This is a dependent system. And when we graph these lines, we'll see that the, the graphs will coincide. Let's begin with the y-intercept 0, comma, negative 1. Here we have a slope of negative 1. So use negative 1 as the rise and 1 unit as the run. Now we can use these two points to graph both of the lines. Notice here there are infinitely many simultaneous solutions. To express such a set, we use the notation x comma mx plus b. In this particular case, we would say the answer is x comma negative x minus 1. This indicates infinitely many ordered pair solutions where x can be any real number.